Welcome to the channel fam. I'm Kim and you're now tuned in to Sweet Kids Creations. <laughs> but listen y'all, it's been this song that's been in my spirit. So beautiful. It's by Men of Standard. And it's, it's called Surround Me. It goes, Surround me, oh God. Get all around me. Until people see. No more. So beautiful. It's so beautiful. So I'm going to charge you to go and read my God. Psalms 18 on today. My God, God is so awesome. Listen, let me tell you something. The only reason that the enemy will be trying to come trying to come up against you is if you had a major breakthrough in the works. The only reason he will be trying to use these people, those dreams, those uh, those intrusive thoughts, huh? Your imagination against you is if the father had something in the works and he know he can't do nothing but give you idle threats. Understand this. God is protecting you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. God is protecting you. Keep trusting in the Father because the only thing he can do is try to make you doubt and try to make you get weary. Do not get weary weary in your well-doing. God's hand is upon you. God is omnipotent, all-powerful. Valiantly, valiantly, mm -mm 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 -mm. with all strength and all courage in the mighty name of Jesus. He's ruling in your situation. Believe him. Even though some of us had to go through a testing period. Come on, Holy Spirit, speak. Some, ooh, some of us had to be reprimanded. Some of us had to be chastened. But God chastises those that he loves. But understand this. If you know that you've come into full repentance and you are sitting here questioning what is going on around you understand that it's, if you've been in that word and you, if you have been in prayer and you've been doing right by the father glory be to god mm, you've humbled yourself before the father and now all of a sudden is this this resistance this pushback guess what's happening the enemy is mad so he's sending everything he can throwing everything but the kitchen sink ain't that what the old people say <laughs> but guess what he has no victory you have, God is going to give you the victory that his name by, might be glorified. That you could go into those rooms and say, hey, it was surely the Lord that brought me through. It wasn't by my own strength. Be encouraged, fam. Do you not perceive the season that you are in? God is saying, I am protecting you. I am working mightily on your case. That breakthrough you've been waiting for, that change you've been trying to make, Huh? You was going into the into the places you had the vision for it, and nobody could see the vision mm? because of your diligence. God will reward you. Glory be to God. Now, Ooh, be encouraged. Do not doubt because you are surrounded. Glory be to God. You are surrounded. God is surrounding you in His glory. He's an and shanda. And those of you that have the gift to hear and see, be mindful of the enemy's plots and plans. Be mindful that he will try to send things to your imagination. Huh? Some people are walking into marriage in the mighty name of Jesus. He will try to come up against your spouse, your kingdom spouse, your ordained husband or wife. Mm -hmm. Make you think things. Why? To turn you away and discourage you. But the Father is increasing. It's an increase of discernment. It's an increase of wealth. It's a wealth transfer. I'm not just talking about prosperity and finances. I'm talking about in your health. I'm talking about in your life. I'm talking about the ease that comes when, when you serve the Lord with all your heart and your soul. With everything that's within you in the mighty name of Jesus. Glory be to God. Thank you, Jesus, for what you're about to do. You know what? 
I heard it was T.D. Jakes. Bishop T.D. Jakes, I heard him say, sometimes you got to praise him in the hallway. And this was years ago. I was going through it, baby. I had lost a house. Had got injured on my job. Had lost everything, right? Oh, Reba Shata was broken, belted, and abused. Alone, felt lonely, and the enemy came to I started praising God in the hallway and trust and believe God. And my grandmother had passed. And anybody that knows me knows that I'm close with my grandmother. My God, when I tell you everything was piling on top of me at one time, and I started to praise God and broke that atmosphere, and God was able to, to, to he was able to touch me in that situation, even though I felt so low. I had to have my faith. I had to use my faith. I had to rabba hakushata. I had to praise him in advance for the things he was about to do because I knew it was something great and mighty about to happen. Now, you know you're in a situation when you got friends and family coming up against you. Hmm? You know you're in a situation when you feel like this relationship is going nowhere. But let me tell you this. Be encouraged. Do not have a spirit of hopelessness. A spirit of heaviness. A spirit of depression in the name of Jesus. I bind and cast you down to the pit of hell in Jesus' name. Be encouraged in the mighty, magnificent name of Jesus. God is doing a new thing. He's doing a new work. He is he's about to bring these things to pass. If you would only believe, glory be to God. He's doing it right now in the name of Jesus. See, Rama Doroku Shanda, in the name of Jesus. I love you out with the love of Christ. And we will talk soon. Glory be to God. Mm, 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 mm.